Welcome back, welcome back. We are here again with another episode of our Pokemon. Pokemon, what the heck was that? Pokemon Platinum Ironmon Nuzlocke. And we did not hit the goal of 250 likes. I didn't even know if I was going to do this encounter or not. But here we go. Ooh. Oh, I'm glad we did this encounter. Oh, I'm glad we did this encounter now. Oh, yeah, baby. Ah, actually, you know what? The issue with this Pokemon, it's two new typings that I don't have. Water being one of them, which is important. Uh, actually, I'm 100% I'm taking this. 100% taking this. I was going to try to, like, justify not taking this, but then I was like... It's a Kabutops. I'm really weak to fire. I'll 100% take it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm taking it. I'm taking it. Well, you're going in a luxury ball. You're going in a luxury ball here. And... Oh, it's kind of a tough thing because this is a classic Pokemon. You know, it's a female Kabutops. This name, I know Tyler put this name down. I know I'm going to look at the comments. I'm going to go with Soup. I'm going to go with Soup because probably about two years ago, I was playing a randomized Nuzlocke. I caught a Kabutops. Someone named Brian had just recently joined the stream. And I was like, hey, yo, Brian, I'm going to name this Kabutops after you. And that man is now Stoma, and he's in the stream all the time. He's in the Discord all the time. Long-standing member of the community. And his wife's nickname is Soup. So it's a female Kabutops. I'm going to go with Soup. We've had Soup on the team before in the past, and it's always turned out to be a pretty good Pokemon. So let's do it. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Clam. But, uh, yeah. Krogunk, you're out of here. I apologize. I apologize, but I just, I, I had a poison type. Didn't really need the fighting typing, unfortunately. And, uh, yeah, Kabutops. Much better addition to the team, to say the least. Let's put you on the team for Kroa Gunk. Jumanji. R.I.P. It's a good Pokemon. If I didn't have, if I didn't have my starter of Zubat, I wouldn't have made this change, honestly. Um, because I would have rather had Firo. Let's see what the ability is. On super relaxed relax nature with oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah that's what we like to see right there oh that's what we like to see oh yeah baby oh boy all right now my issue is going to be keeping this thing alive uh <laughs> Because it is such a frail Pokemon that it's kind of terrifying. Oh, you can't learn Fake Out. That would have been so good. Do I want to put Fake Out on anybody right now? I don't think so. Oh, uh, if Kabutops could have learned Fake Out, huge power Fake Out from a Kabutops would actually be pretty broken, to be fair. Um, oh, I need to grind him up a little bit. See, this is right here where I would just like to have the cheats honestly because it would like the rare candies because i would just get him to level 17 get him on power with the rest of the team and just go about my day but i don't have them on right now i kind of feel like i just should because right now i'm just gonna like waste time doing this instead of just getting to level 17 so i think i'm gonna do that i'll be right back all right i got it in here uh it gives me a bunch of rare candies i know some people don't really like the idea of glitching in rare candies to do this but it's literally just saving me time because before I even started this episode, I spent probably 10 minutes grinding up my the rest of my guys to level 17. Whereas this just gets me to level 17. It's just all it does is save me time. You know, it's really not like cheating in a sense. You know what I mean? And I guess it kind of might feel like it to some people, but I'm literally just going to get to level 17. Just so he's kind of on par with like my lowest level. And then I'm going to go about my day. Um, when it comes to these YouTube videos, it's not like a, the live streams. I've I don't describe this before, but it just, it literally just saves me time <laughs> and time is very precious. Uh, as you're, you know, getting in this business, you know, the time you could save doing one thing over another's could be extremely important. So, you know, I'm going to take these opportunities to save time when I can. Um, trust me, it doesn't change the integrity of the game at all or my chances of losing it or winning it, you know? Don't worry about all that. 
All right, we got a Suicune. I'm pretty sure the uh, Team Rocket lady in here, I forget her name, Mars, I think it is. Um, I believe she's like level 20. Or like, pretty sure she's a pretty high level. I'm a little nervous about this, this fight, to be honest. You got the flinch, okay? Let's see, I gotta get the leech seed off. Mega Drain's not gonna do too much damage to a Suicune. Critical hit. Need to calm down. You need to calm down there. All right, how much am I getting back from this? I think a bite crit could kill me. I'm gonna potion. I, I'm not risking Zesty. I refuse. Clear. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like that. I do not like that. Go for Mega Drain. Go for Rain Dance. Okay. That's fine with me. So we can come back for Vengeance after the last playthrough. Oh, I guess I could have just clicked. I guess I could have just clicked that twice. Man, I am underestimating Sunflower, man. Seriously. You are a strong Pokemon. Super strong Pokemon. All right. Mm -hmm. This out of the way. Is this your only Pokemon? Hey, hey, hey! Easy. Oh, grab my controller. Easy. Pick it up. Thank you. Here, I'm hiding behind that. That's so annoying. Break my controller because of these cats. All right. Yeah, you go run. You go run. I gotta go talk to the dude in the little forest thing over here. Um, Route 205 encounter I've left untouched. So I still have that one to go. Um, I probably will get it after the Mars encounter because you have to run through the grass a couple times, I think, to get to the like get to the next forest. So chances are I'm going to run into one of them. Um, I'll save until after this battle. If I do catch something, I'm going to add to the team. Cool. I mean, this is honestly a really solid team. For this early in, the, in an Ironmon to have this like well-rounded of a team is kind of insane. Kind of insane. The only dual typing I have right now is flying, and flying typing is one of the best typings to have, like dual of. Larvitar. Um, I'm gonna go for a Rock Smash. Ah, oh, Soup, you are a beautiful Pokemon. Oh, this is going to be so good. This is going to be so good. If it could learn Fake Out, that would have been so good. Fake Out would have been so good. Octillery, I am switching out. Um, Into Zesty. Right into Zesty. Moody, is Moody an ability in this game? anyone know off the top of their head not 100 sure if it is uh if it is i thought of it obviously because of artillery that's one of its abilities that makes it super broken sometimes um if i find a random pokemon with moody that can that's the ultimate setup sweeper such a broken ability roar beam with my thick fat doing no damage no damage Mm -mm -mm. Alrighty. Deal with that. Then we gotta go. I do feel like, because today's gonna be a normal length episode, I do feel like I'm running out of time. <laughs> Oddly enough, I feel like I'm like, wow, all right. You know, 12 minutes into the episode? That's crazy. I'm almost halfway done. But I do like these shorter episodes. In these shorter episodes, around 20, 30 minutes is like ideal for. As a content, from my point of view, um, a 20 to 30 minute video will kind of garnish the same results as an hour long video, if not better, because a lot of people will see an hour long video and be like, I'm not watching an hour long video. No way. And it'll just not have as many views. Um, even the, you know, the, the hardcore supporters of it will watch it and it'll still end up doing pretty solid you know it's just as 
someone trying to grow their channel technically hour-long episodes are worse for me but i know the people who really ride out for me and you know are here supporting as hard as you guys are supporting i'm doing it for you guys so you know i don't mind them i really don't and you guys honestly even though we didn't hit the 250 likes we still got like 170 or something which is insane i like a hundred likes was the goal like th two episodes ago like a hundred i was like nah, there's no way we'll hit a hundred and i'm like oh okay i guess we're gonna hit a hundred like nope nothing so i'll go for 200 hit that like it's nothing i was like mind blown so don't feel like just because we didn't hit the goal one time that you know i'm not appreciative of the support i still received um I'm just trying to keep the hour-long episodes a little bit to a minimum. <laughs> Banana boy, Geki. Oh, man. Soup is going to be broken. Soup is going to be broken. You know what I'll do? You know what I'll do? This is a, this is an idea. I don't know how this would work. I'm not sure if this would be like a good thing or not. But I was going to say, as an idea, if... I feel like, say, this Kabutops, I end up, it ends up being able to learn like a really good move. And it ends up being super broken. I would say, like, if we hit, like, 300 likes on a video, I'll release it. Or something crazy like that. I'm sorry. I'm already talking about releasing soup, even though it just joined the team. But it's just, it's just a thought, okay? Just a, just a little fun thought to toy with, you know? I don't think I would actually want to do that. I don't know if I would actually want to do that. Churro. I love the name Churro. So good. I got this Mars battle. Banana boy, Eric. All right. Go right into it. This is an important battle. This is a tough battle. They're going to have six Pokemon. This is going to be a doozy of a battle. We'll probably wrap up after this, depending on how it goes. I mean, it could destroy him pretty quickly. Stripper Mish. Oh, first, don't talk about my wife like that. And, of course, they lead with a grass type. The one type. And I was like, just please don't lead with one of those and we'll be fine. You'll lead with it, but it's okay. We got Churro on deck. You had Vine Whip. We eat that up. Doing nothing. We deal with uh, we deal with grass types extremely well on team, so that's why Kabutops is actually a... Hey! Okay, that's why Kabutops is a really good member to have, because it's weak to grass, but I literally have four grass resists on my team out of six Pokemon, so I think I'm all right. This is doing a lot of damage, though. Honestly, doing seven damage with Vine Whip is kind of crazy to a Metagross if you're two levels above i'm like i assume everything has huge power <laughs> how my brain works when i do these randomizers barbooch oh baby oh let's go zesty let's go zesty show you a four times grass weakness show me how it works huh all right so this isn't as high level as i thought these aren't the ace they're all level 18 which i mean that is actually really good you know it is a good uh level for six pokemon that's you know i have two pokemon level 18 or level 19. I got outplayed. I got outplayed. It's okay. We're gonna eat that up. We're gonna eat that up like a schnuffin. Critical hit! Of course! Why wouldn't it be? Whatever. Whatever, Barboach. Get you out of here. Alright, what else you got for me? Low Ted. Um. Ooh, and I just realized the sand is good for this. Man, I might kind of want to keep sand on Deer Clops. I have Sand Veil on Firo, Metagross and Donphan, and Kabutops all benefit from sand. Huh. I might have to keep sand on the team. Might be a good idea. I mean, I thought I'd have a choice. Once it evolves, I'm going to let it evolve. It doesn't have sand. So be it. Oh, what is this? Natural gift, but it failed. Huh. Get wrecked. And Deer Clops is experience pain. This was the ace. So the team ended up being not as threatening because the ace ended up being a low tad, which is not a not a problem. Whatsoever. But uh yeah, we'll see, we'll see. I mean you never know. Just still got a couple Pokemon left, right? Still got three Pokemon left, so. Send out like a Rayquaza next. There were actually Rayquazas in the grass 
in this and right before the city which was kind of nuts all right sandstorm rages metagross okay um I'm gonna go soup because I'm neutral to steel. So and I have pretty good physical defense if he tries going for metal claw. And the sand is up, which increases my special defense because I'm a rock type. I'm gonna go for a rock smash. So I have huge power, and this is neutral. It goes for magnet rise, okay. If I get one defense drop, we're kinda chilling. No claw, see how much this does. It's neutral because water resists, but rock is weak. Oh, we eat that up. Eat that up, baby. All right, soup. Huge power. Oh, what do you got now? What do you got more berries? You boosted the accuracy? Okay. Well, I guess you could miss Metal Claw. There's an option. All right, get him out of here. Level 18 Metagross. Whew. I mean, that could have been a problem. Very well could have been a problem for the team. Metang? Seriously? Seriously? You had both? What's up with this? Can we get a defense drop? Come on. Come on, Soup. Now you got huge power. I'm, I'm trying to be greedy over here. Defense drop could have saved me a turn, possibly. You're so annoying. Oh! Oh, that did a lot. Go on a meatball. Did a lot of damage. Yo, Metang might have huge... I think everything has huge power, but like... I mean, these don't look... They don't seem that crazy. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Soup's level 20. Still got another Pokemon. One more left, aren't right? Trico, back for revenge. Back for revenge. I'm going Deerclops. Uh, I would like to get Firo just to get Firo some screen time today, but uh, I need this to level up the most. This is the thing I'm really trying to obviously get evolved as soon as possible so that I can get a Golbat and uh, get rid of the Sand ability, even though I do, I do like it right now. It is good for my team at the moment. Is very good for my team at the moment. Alrighty, that is a G. A G. Huh. Team wasn't that crazy. Got a little lucky. I'll take it. I'll take it. I ain't complaining. I ain't complaining. Beat him up. Beat him. Beat him up. Stripper Mish. My wife is not a stripper. All right. That is disrespectful. Disrespectful. All right. What do you got for me? nothing oh 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 ooh. you know it's gonna work out extremely well the drift bloom or drift loons show back up every friday after you complete this area i've never come back to encounter the drift uh, drift loons but i wrap up the episode right now which i'm going to do it's gonna be a short episode but you guys got some long episodes in the past couple days so this is going to be a shorter one. But at the start of the next episode, please, please, dear God, don't let me forget. Can someone leave comments to say, don't forget the Drift Loon? Don't forget the Drift Loon. Please just put that in so that I hopefully remember to do it. Um, but I will go get that Static Encounter. I don't know. I don't know if it's just like standing somewhere. I really have never done it before. But I'll do it tomorrow because tomorrow's Friday. And uh, yeah, make sure you leave a like. The same like goals will uphold 100 on YouTube, 250 on Facebook because you savages really like hitting that like button but we hit those goals I'll go for another hour we'll go for another hour and make sure you leave some nicknames because we are going to get a couple encounters next episode I'll see you in the next one peace out